Okay, do not here. worry, and that is how you can add standard space pigment to a number of human inventions to completely change their exterior shell in reference to the standard radiation broadcast from Gravity Well number 437 located outside of the moon's front door. It is practically beachfront property. I think just hearing that made some of my hair fall out. <laughs> yes, much like the moon, your skull shall soon be hairless. Oh, like Lordy. To, I'd like to welcome oh. uh, all of our viewers that are currently here to um, tonight's episode of <laughs> Shit Comes Out of Squick's Mouth While We Try to Paint. Um, so, uh, okay. Um, so, apparently, we're the first thing to broadcast since yesterday, if the... Uh, if the the setup is right, so hot damn, we're number one. We're we're number we're one. Number one. We're, we're number, number one. one. Uh, Squick, uh, Fezbear wants you to read more Amazon product reviews. I Hi, shall Grimos. read several product reviews of standard human product. Okay, so um, well, cr oh, well, no, because of, because everyone's bit everyone it, a lot of the the legion is. In location, alpha, uh, beta redacted, uh, doing 
doing such things, and so uh, and they have that's retreated to you know, site beta. Yeah. Where they shall have experiences. Cookie and I will be retreating to uh, Site B tomorrow. Amazon yep. wishes to tempt me with an off-brand thermal camera, allowing me to see the temperature of things. But the joke is on them. I can do that by using my human hand. That's true. Your your the human body cannot sense whether or not something is wet. It depends on the uh, the fact that. Uh, wet things have a different conductivity. The body detects difference in temperatures. Partially correct. If I lick someone, they will determine they are soggy. Ew. A problem. Let's not lick people, please. Okay, I'm still in teacher mode because I've been at school till like five minutes ago. Because wow. we had a thing tonight. It was pumpkin palooza, so I'm pumpkined out. Okay, I'm even wearing November a... November 3rd. <laughs> I'm wearing a pumpkin shirt, too. Now, is that like a standard cloth shirt, or is that one of those giant industrial-style pumpkins, and you just, like, you shirt have it with a jack-o'-lantern on it. Okay, there so you was... don't have to, like, punch your way out, and then you're I like, didn't I'm taste any grundo. pumpkin. And I then... didn't taste any pumpkins. I just played with pumpkin candy and read a story about pumpkins. Okay, night. so you didn't have to, like, suplex the pumpkin to establish dominance. Quentin, right. I'm like... <laughs> I'm David S. Pumpkins, y'all. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> Questions? <laughs> Are we supposed to say hi Roy. to the viewers? More Probably hi, Probably viewers. viewers. <laughs> Guess they can't see who's talking. They're just oh, like, crap. ah, yes, the funny internet Noise. box is saying weird things again. Okay, real quick. I'm going to, I'm going to do some, I'm going to do some stuff. Um, um, Let's see how this works. How does this work again? Okay, okay. Diggs know. is indisposed for the week, so I don't have any of your submissions. Sorry. Yay! <laughs> That's why I'm, I do want to steal your host microphone for a moment and suggest okay. that you may want to have us do the quick rundown of who's here. So okay, know yeah. who's invading so, I mean, their it's, ear holes. it's in the title, but I mean, go ahead. Uh, I'm here. Hi. Psydox in chat. Oh my god. You are all the worst. Um, All right. This is, this is Squack. Hi, Squack. Yes, hello! Um, I am Cookie from the Black Pants Legion. Hello, everybody. She is Cookie from the preschool. <laughs> hello, my name is Warlax, and I'm an alcoholic. I believe it. <laughs> Let me tell you something, brother. This is Halzakar of the Black Pants Legion, you rude dude. Okay, oh, yes, I'm all of be... the rude humans are now here as I interrupt Parallax to tell you all that you are going to have a very good show. It is mandatory. A d mandatory fun. Mandatory fun. Alzakar, aren't you still a trial? No, he's not. No! Well, congratulations! No Gosh! Uh, it's been... A couple, couple weeks. Months. One week since you no, looked at me. No, it's not been months. It's been weeks. <clears throat> weeks are very similar to months, except that they are much longer. In reverse, because of math. In other words, words came out of Squick's mouth before his brain caught up. <laughs> Sarvak makes an interesting question. Is next week going to be all viewer submissions? Christ, <laughs> at this rate, probably. It's going to be like last possibly. week. Possibly. Possibly. What happened last week? Well, I had 136,000 viewer submissions. We burned through them in what? 20 minutes. It was a hell of a thing. We what happened? Very efficient. What happened last week? Well, uh, Warlax got super sick, and uh, Warlax yeah. had the deadly Matumba virus. No, Warlax had influenza. Now I'm going to stick with the deadly Matumba virus. Warlax is available for download. As Warlax, we have established you, uh... in this chat before, um, I, I lament the loss of Clerks the Cartoon Show, and the deadly Matumba virus was a good joke. Warlox, are you telling us you were down with the sickness? God, I wish I was a mod so I could boot you. <laughs> so that's the response that that really deserves. <laughs> okay, Warlax, Indeed. here's what you sent me. This is a thing Warlax sent me. Warlax, tell the nice people about the thing. Uh, the, the, the nice people uh, need to know that uh, recently we had a Legion tournament. Uh, th th this is the tank, uh, some death troopers, 
uh, director Krennig, and operative Vader, operative and Vader. and a random snow speeder because I've always wanted to paint a snow speeder, and there is a snow speeder model. There we go. It is like a seagull bang day space manta ray. Yeah, the the fighter tank is um real interesting. And it I, has I, angry eyebrows. I just want to stop real quick and point out that uh Toilet Obliterator has joined us and wants Hello. us to know that and like I, I'm never gonna be able to think of members of the ox in any other way again because he has popped in and told us that he has oxtism. Okay. Oh my. I wish I had words, but I am I have several. Would you like to borrow them? Well, I mean, really how would is not. a car? You're you're the only one in here that's formally oxtistic. Yeah, that's true. I was indeed. And uh no, I'm not arguing with them. I am not arguing with them at all. Just no. Somebody is they have stolen you it. for nefarious he is, purposes. He is not wrong. No, but uh that that fighter tank, um I've done a lot of weathering on it, and I i don't know, I'm just, there's something missing, and I'm not happy with it, and I'm taking it into work tomorrow so that my uh, work colleague can look at it and tell me, oh, that's because you haven't done this, you idiot. Well, or looking like, at what you were these, Where were these fighter tanks typically deployed to that we'd be familiar with? Um, th there was a, th th they kind of originated in a game for the GameCube that was called Republic Fighter. Really? Because I, I know it from Battlefront 2, the original one. Yep, this was like 2002. It was right after the Clone Wars came out. Oh, okay, okay, so what you need, I believe... Where, where were is, they deployed? The ground? Yeah, mostly. I believe you need um, splatters of red and, and ripped Jawa robes Maybe all over the front of it. Maybe that's what it was called. It. Maybe it was just called the Clone Wars. Like I, I can't even remember, but it was it was a very generically named GameCube game. The Sam know. Master, oh come on, I'm a mom and we have two other dads here, lay them on us. This is true. Yes, and also I am here for judgment. And Squick is here for the judgment of the human. Now, Warlocks, real quick, the thing that I want to add is, if it were me, I would go through and I would pick out all the little details that look like, it looks like there are some, uh, some shackles on here and the gun barrels and that kind of, and I would, I, I would paint those gunmetal. I think that would uh, pop them out a little more. So it might, yeah. From the sidelines, by all like, means, the uh, the painting equivalent of I am not a lawyer. However, that's a tank, but it looks like it's painted more like an aircraft, where it's had delicate, loving attention and people who cared, instead of people who are mad inside a giant fucking steel box that keeps ringing like a bell whenever the goddamn crunchies over there get bored and decide to have some target practice. This is not true. This is this is not untrue. Which which is what uh may uh Arkanesh says is maybe some flaking and some rubbed and bumped sense, you know, sense it, it, of it, like I said, I've been doing a lot of weathering on it. it I actually sent in just this uh, for my final uh, stuff last week, and uh, mm -hmm. I've been so sick, I've not been able to watch to see if it came up. Um, it did. But, it did. Okay. But there are bumps, there are laser burns, there are a bunch of other stuff. You just can't really see them in that photo, which okay. might be... Uh, which might be why... Nah. That could I just have, be the I have an here. idea. I have an idea. This is, Yo, this is why it you takes need, us 30 minutes to get to painting. You need a disembodied bantha head on the right front uh, section there. Just put, a you big, one over. just put a big pair of horns right on the front of it like it's why the Cadillac. Wh why the fuck is everything tattooing? Tattooing. <laughs> tattooing. It's, it's, it's easy to run things up. over there. No, because it keeps popping up in the fucking movies because deserts are cheap. They're like, hmm, we need That's somewhere true. to film for strange and exotic film sets. And they're like, hmm, but buildings are expensive. What if just sand? That sounds cheap. And it's like, buddy, have I got a deal for you? We've got a planet that's <laughs> nothing but... And they're like, ah, perfect. We will have all secret bases there for tax purposes. Which is sure. exactly how they talk. That's it. That's, that's the Tatooine accent. 
There but uh, but the idea is the snow speeder is going to be uh, done up in the standard way, except the orange will be uh, a dark like swamp green because uh, they were we know them as snow speeders because they were. Uh, featured in Empire Strikes Back, mm -hmm. but they were actually more commonly referred to as swamp speeders because they could get around in the muddy ground on swamps and stuff like that, whereas tanks had issues. Yeah, Maybe my memory is off, but I seem to remember in Empire they just called them speeders, didn't they? They were uh, speeders that they were retrofitting for the snow. Correct. They oh, they were they were known as speeders, but uh, colloquially they have been referred to as snow speeders. And I think in reprints of uh, the book for Empire, uh, they were uh, referred to as snow speeders. Yes. Okay. I was just trying to go Morgana. To Morgana, I hear you. I hear your Stargate, and I agree. It's not just Stargate, like. You're absolutely right, but it's not like half of everything that was recorded for sci-fi. Actually, probably more than half. Everything recorded for the sci-fi channel in the aughts was in Vancouver. So, in that same vein of all sci-fi sharing a universe, are you familiar with the most important machine in the world? I'm going to let you tell me. Hot dog rollers? No, no. It is this weird prop that shows up in the back of every sci-fi series. And it's a series of... Uh, I believe it's three fluorescent tubes that fire in a uh, uh, like a triangular order where it looks like a circular pulse of energy. But the prop was made for something in like the mid 80s and it's just been bouncing between sets ever since. I think I have heard of this thing. I think I've seen something about this. But more importantly, th there is another very important sci-fi prop. Oh, good. Grimos has gotten over his uh, thing of using the wrong email account to send in... Hot man! Just in time for us to not be able to see it. You've, you've also got the, uh, the sci-fi thing that goes bing! The machine that goes ping is a vital medical development. This is true. Okay. Primarily for billing. Uh, and also the ice cream maker from Empire, that's right. They also used it in Book of Boba Fett. I like I, that was one of the things I liked about Book of Boba Fett. I one have not yet things. seen Book of Boba Fett. It's pretty terrible, honestly. I mean, okay, fair. I I do want to take just a moment to bitch about snow speeders, though. Can we oh, do that okay. while you move on okay. to the next picture? Okay, okay next okay. picture. Thing did I did. You, you go ahead and you bitch about snow speeders. Um, I, I will probably fight you. Their guns are bent. It's a laser, okay. man. Okay. Their laser gun is bent. Yeah. Yeah, it's a it's yeah. a bent laser gun. It's it's shooting no. out uh, fiber optics. It's fine. It's fine. No, except it's not a laser. It's a blaster. Canonically, they are different. Somehow, you use uh, charged gas particles to make a laser that explodes when it hits. Very different. Very advanced. Sure. Hey, Para. So, wing, this is Paras. Para, this like is pretty your, cool. Uh, Thank you. I like your, your Sam's Iran there. Okay, so this was a release from the Patreon of Arakio Studios. Arakio, unfortunately, is discontinuing their Patreon because of Ooh. life problems. Uh, they're going to continue to release their stuff on cults. So as that moves forward, I'm probably going to continue to buy their stuff because it's fucking rad. Anyway. That is fairly ballin'. This, I, I was happy. Like, the, they actually did two of these. Like, there's this pose, and then the other pose is... I'll, I'll show it on camera when we get to it, but it's Samus standing sideways with one arm on her blaster, exactly the way her sprite is in the game. It's I love it. It's fantastic. Cool. Yeah, okay. that's really cool. So, so um, the only thing, well, I'm assuming you're going to, is this in progress or done? Uh, it was something to occupy me at the time. I wouldn't say it's okay. done. Okay, I was just saying you may want to do a little bit of, like, metallic -y on it. A little bit of highlight. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Other than that, it's beautiful. Thanks. It's absolutely gorgeous. Perhaps you'd like to use Rainy River Designs metallics. No. I have those. I know you do, and I'm actually kind of jealous because I have some of them, and their metallics are fantastic. They are. Rainy River Designs, guys. They're awesome. 
Okay, what's I, mm-hmm. I got a couple of these way people. down south you've seen, on the rainy river. You've seen Not this quite. star spawn of Cthulhu before. This is mostly I got the stuff I wanted for basing it. Uh, so standing on rocks, I'm intending on getting some uh, clear silicone caulking to kind of make like water and waves splashing up on this. And nice. On the, okay, yeah. on the one hand, I totally get it, and that's going to look awesome. On the other hand, I'm looking at that pose, uh-huh. and that is also the pose of getting out of the shower. <laughs> that's true. It's not wrong. I mean, they live in the ocean. Yeah, that's just the big shower. I mean, I, mean, I, I can't. I can, if they live in the ocean. It's a big I, shower with free crabs. You can just reach out and grab them. I can uh, teach you a technique for actually having static... Uh, dripping water and you can make it like he's getting out of the shower i'm not gonna do that I'm wait gonna do does that. amazon sell a tiny shower i must look it up oh christ he's gonna read us reviews of a tiny shower that amazon sells for like <laughs> hamsters or something <laughs> oh okay i got one more um this one is gonna be a surprise for when i get to location redacted because uh as far as I can tell, the people at Location Redacted are not currently watching the show. So, uh... They might, they might be, be eating copious amounts be. of food. I believe they are in the midst of jackboxery. Well, oh, that's right. They are doing jackboxery. So, for those of you that have been listening to the podcast lately, there's this. <laughs> okay, now that I have context for that image. <laughs> oh, Yes. <laughs> Oh, yes. Oh, oh no. Uh, see, I, I finished the last episode that is up on that uh, today, and my only response to it is, why the hell did Tex give them a Vortex grenade? I, it's fine. Do Some- not spoil. I haven't heard any of it yet. I haven't heard any of it yet. No spoilers. Uh, I'm not telling you how they used it or anything else. Cease. Okay. Uh, this one, we just want to drop here. There's... there's- yeah. G17 but, Delta, come in. <laughs> okay, so uh, our boys from Delta here, um, these are not models that exist anywhere. <laughs> none of um, these are one model. None of these are, in fact, two models. Every one of these is made up of at least three different models that I kit bash together, rigged in Blender, and then posed <sighs> with many, many, many fucking headaches. Oh How's my it? god. Good <laughs> what? job, dude. Why why did you give Griglack a pistol? So we can because throw they it. They all have a pistol and also the catechin that uh, I stole the arms from uh, had a yes. pistol in that hand. Yes, Vectron, that that's what I'm trying to get at is um, uh, he is missing his magic sword. I want to make a point here. I based the art on this from a piece that Adonius <laughs> has done that I don't think has been officially released yet. Uh, Griglock has a a chain sword in that art, and he is holding a chain sword here. You're just looking at it head on. Oh, okay. That makes sense. So Griglock have chain sword and funny shaped club with which to charge. Magic sword. (laughs) (laughs) Big magic, much sword. Download now. (laughs) And then, you know, Uriah is having a bad day. With his uh, cult monitor over there. But yeah, yeah, this is, I honest to God, over the weekend, I think I spent two full working days on this. Wow. Why does That's that shower head work. have a boat propeller? Sorry, I, I still have Amazon open. No, that is awesome. That's ah, that that is, great. That is really good stuff. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So now let's move on to an actual camera. So okay. that that leaves uh, Goat's character, I think it's Uriah, being no, the one sitting Quint. down. Quint. Quint is... Uh, no, wait, Goat's character. Yeah, you're right. Uriah is the one sitting down, and he has <laughs> a cult monitor over there. He's having a bad day. As oh, is tradition. Ha- has he taken one down? And what? passed it around? No, uh, no. Yeah, ha- ha- I'm, has he... I'm going to say no further questions on the show. Let's <laughs> yes. Let's leave no, it no, no. until it's been out uh, for about a year. No, he said he said he's had a bad day. I said, has he taken one down? No. I was hoping someone would return with yes, yes, exactly. 
I have no idea what's going on. I, I was waiting for someone to say, did he sing a sad song and try to turn it around? Um, uh, <laughs> nope. I think Chad's ready for me to break some paint out. Okay, I told Let's you. Some I paint. Had, no more on your guns. Here we go. Arakio had this. I showed this off in the uh, the the who's a what's it with the finger jigger. This is the other one that they made. So you can see it's oh it's uh, Sam oh, yeah. with her gun. There. This is the most perfect model of a Metroid piece I've ever seen, and I love it. I love this so fucking much. It is pretty great. Uh, Where did you get that wear you some gloves sticker? Uh, that came from is someone in chat ask? Okay, uh, that came from wear you some gloves came from the uh, the website of the craftsman. Uh, that's C-R-A-F-S-M-A-N. Oh, I still have the pumpkin in here. Uh, pumpkin. Let's get rid of the pumpkin. By the way, your child is asleep. I have I've heard. Uh, yes, uh, we're continuing to hear uh, how don't put the null oil on your gums. Oh. Don't what do, do I do if I have? Well, I mean, this is that episode of It's Always Sunny in Phil uh, Philadelphia where they're rubbing cocaine on their gums because they don't know how to do cocaine. Yeah, Humans can ingest several is. powders into a number of orifice selections. Yeah, they shouldn't. Lord. And then, um, yeah. Zarvek, um, Offspring are doing much better. They had strep last week. They're better. Oh, uh, that's good. So, uh, so, better. so what you're saying is the kids are all right. Uh, yeah. well. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, dear. Sorry, Car. I hope you feel better soon. Oh, there's a fucking story. Yeah, I told you the story last week. Everything that happened last week with uh, Paragon of Wives and Women, now she has strep on top of it. So, oh lord. Anyway. So tonight I'm gonna paint a thing. Um let's see. <laughs> Last week I painted this awesome over here in Bengals colors because why the fuck not? I'm thinking this Thunderbolt this week. What do you guys think? Thunder, thunder, thunderbolt. I'm regretting oh. writing. I'm really okay. I'm really regretting okay. you at this point. Okay, ju just just because of that, uh, we have to take the lead character from Thundercats and uh, paint the Thunderbolt as that character. I have to make Lino. fucking Lion-O? Yep. <laughs> we have replaced the missile tubes with unlimited small lasers at the cost of one per missile. Oh. It is a disco ball of short-range terror and poor <laughs> heat management. I mean, you could do Panthro, but chat would rebel. All these panthers gray. Shit, now I gotta like dig out kind of yellowish paint. And... Or we can get the colors from the Thunder Tank. Snarf, oh, yes, snarf. The Thunder Tank. Which was definitely not just a mech on a skateboard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't have a tiny skateboard sitting here. I can't do that. No, that Let's attitude. see, what else do I have? Just just uh for the sake of argument, what else do I have? I have some um, definitely not orcs or space orcs or whatever you want to say. Definitely, distinctly not 40k orcs. 40k <laughs> orcs don't stand up like this. This is not a 40k orc. Um, 40 I cork. A, I have a I have a Kentaro. Let's see. Uh, oh. da, 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 there's rebel soldier. And there's, man. No, no. You said thunderbolt, and my, then there was the joke about my, thundercats, and now you my, have to do a thundercat my, thunderbolt. No, then Notorian spends just like PPC, give me range beyond range. <laughs> that, that joke I deserves just want to make a, a point medal. real quick. <laughs> the Thunderbolt in its base configuration doesn't have PPC, it has large laser. But still. Yes, but still. Okay. Range pick out range. Also, I'm hearing an echo. I don't know if somebody's got their I, am I don't not know. Hearing I'm hearing an echo. Uh, let's. Not that. Where's my runic gray? We'll use the runic gray. Alexa, play. <laughs> That's um, sad. Alexa, play Despacito. Despacito. Oh, whoa. This is going to mess up the stop. YouTube. Alexa, stop. Alexa, or you shut could the force hell up. it to play Poke Rap. <laughs> 
<laughs> Paris just going to pull his mic out of the computer and we're going to have to do all the commentary for him. No, 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 no. It's a wireless mic. It's fine. Shut up. Alexa, play Albuquerque. You're on a headset, motherfucker. What are you going to do about it? <laughs> Perhaps if we are very loud, your skull will resonate and force the obelisk to do as we will. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Grimos. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so... <laughs> and Toilet Obliterator piping in with... It's Thunderbolt Thursday in WBPL 76. Watch the carnage on the Canopus Slaughter Pit, now on pay-per-view. Thursday, 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 only at the Canopus Slaughter Pits. Come see combat like you've rarely seen before. Yes, that's right. It's two full-size Battle Mac minimum going toe-to-toe, head-to-head, -to -toe, -to and gun-to-gun -gun in the pit of slaughter. We've got specialty rounds to deal with pesky livestock, unwanted prisoners, and those damn invading invaders from the place we don't like beyond the stars. Not to mention clan special packs. That's right, we have no less than four elementals looking to take down one of the big guns. Available this Thursday exclusively at the Slaughter Pit. Get your tickets now. Intermission Disclaimer. feature animals roasted by the flamers. First come, first serve. Disclaimer. Full-size Battle Mac is not a Battle Mac. Full-size Battle Mac is, in fact, a Cattle Master. Cattle Masters are not Battle Macs. I disagree. Unless you live in, unless you live in the Trinity world. And then... Get out of the way. <laughs> if it can lift a cow, it can lift a car. And if it can lift a car, it can throw a car. And if it can throw a car, that's mech enough for me. Wait. Does it lift a cow or does it make it move? I hate you. I know. <laughs> if you can dodge a car, you can dodge a cow. <laughs> but it's the car a dodge. It's a no. Car. Car, you like that joke too much for someone to hit me. <laughs> Search your feelings. You know this to be true. No, uh, no, no. The red guard is still in the box. No emperor. Meh. Red guard, we're going to Skyrim now. Uh, no. Uh, as in, I know, I know, I know. I'm making a dumb joke. Sorry. Okay. Awake. <laughs> and she says I have your wife's phone number. Yep. I know. Tried to catch uh, Too you bad. Tried to sneak across the border, did you? Too bad Mrs. Icar is asleep right now. Think she won't get woken up? <laughs> Morado know, likes she... Morado likes the dumb jokes, so there you what, go. What We've makes you think that time. her being woken up is gonna make her amenable to helping? Uh because yeah. we're gonna tell her it's your fault. <sighs> it's not my fault. You're the ones making the phone call. <laughs> yeah, but when she gets the phone call, she's just going to find out it's your fault. And before she finds out what's going on, she's going to hit you. Uh, what's going on? Many humans possess cellular phones used for violence. Okay. This is why they offer additional insurance for cracked screens. Okay, lion -O. Let's see. lion o lion -O, lion -O. Why do you have uh, yes, a Cat weird Man, no pants. fucking cutout in the middle of your torso, lion -O? He possesses several torsos according okay. to the action figure lobby. Okay. Allow me. For the sake of my sanity, we're doing 2011, lion -O, because he wears fucking pants. Understandable. <laughs> now you are forced to imagine mech pants. I do no, have I a plan. Ha no, I hang on. I have a plan when I get another Banshee blank to do. I'm going to put khaki on the legs, black on the feet. I'm going to put a color on the torso with a V under the head. It's going to cut off halfway down the arms. I'm going to use flesh tones to make it look like it has a polo shirt on, and it will be a business casual Banshee. God, how disconcerting would it be to have just a regular mech and nothing but flesh tones? <laughs> Well, we can find that out too. And you know what? And you know what? You know what they call it? They call it Jaybird. Oh no! Also, thank you, Toilet Obliterator, who's it's gifted a two one sub to Marado thirteen thirteen. Let's see. Let's see. I've been sitting on this Marauder two for a while. This shouldn't take long. Let's pull you out. 
Ah, oh, okay. yes, the humans hatch their marauders much like chickens do eggs. The this marauder, too, is nearly ready to hatch. This is yeah, true. It's clucked up. That's, that's... Why did I invite you on this show? You have made poor decisions, but now we are in your chat. Oh, Christ. Uh, what the internet is my son. to sell me seashells. I'm in your stream making your jokes. Yes, my son. I hate How can I help you? This. I'm hated. I hate it. I hate it. Oh, wow, that's a little bit. <laughs> All right, I am gonna go get food because food, and I'll be right back. Okay, yeah. food. Have okay, fun and so enjoy your meal. Let's see what happens. I did, when we I did forget to get this the, marauder. I did forget to get the beer that I was gonna have, so I'll be back in a moment. All right, have fun with human beverage made from historically accurate grain. Quick, we have to end the stream right now. He's gone. Beep boop. You guys are Jim, right. you have to put up with it. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> and Derberger, in answer to your question, a lifetime of experience. Oh god, I didn't even see the question. Uh, let's see. And Amazon is attempting to sell me both um food storage baskets uh -huh. and slip on tub diverter spout. I don't know what that means. I, it's the schwangus that you have to, like, fondle in your shower in order to make water come out of the top thing. Ah. The schwangus. Schwangus that you have to fondle. Oh, boy. I, unless you have a lever-actuated shower, in which case the mechanism is entirely different. In fact, my parents have a shower where the diverter is actually a dial. Yes, you can is... dial your shower the way you prefer. Which is weird. Vectron says, color choice aside, I do like that Marauder 2 model. Thank Which you. Which one is that, Parallax? I'm pretty sure this is just straight up the Mech Warrior Online one from Syllogy. I think. I don't think this one's special. I think this is just like the free one you can get from Syllogy's My Mini Factory. Excellent. Oh, no. They're also really fun if you ever have free time on a large FDM printer to just make giant mech. This is true. I have seen people like, do this, and it makes me jealous of FDM printers. I have done it, and it was very fun. I am reminded, at some point, Squick, I need you to print something for me FDM and send it to me, if that's not a problem. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I, I am so bad at shipping things out. But yes, yes, I'm Yes, yes, Squick, <laughs> I believe that we are aware. Uh, yeah, really. I own boxes now, so That's I've taken part steps. Of the process. Okay, because like I, there are uh, there are files out there for a filtering funnel. That's just basically a two layer funnel for filtering of isopropyl alcohol. And like I fabricated one out of regular funnels, but I'd rather have you know one that's not janky as fuck. Well, um. So there's one thing that I have honestly been thinking of for FDM for a while, and it kind of came to a head today, and I have no idea if anyone has ever made it. Oh, proceed with your query. Camino clone, uh, cloning facility uh, style terrain. I would be surprised if it's not out there, but it would be a weird thing to look for. Yeah, the like keywords are going to be odd, but I love it's a challenge. Also, it's also probably hiding on somebody's gum road somewhere deep in the bowels of the internet. <laughs> oh, I'm going to guess that it's easier to find than that. Wait, was that hand-powered drill? What the fuck? <laughs> that's that's called a bit brace. squeeze drill. Oh, fuck. I have a bit brace, but that's not a... This is... This is interesting. I'm going to drop it in the Discord. Okay, Squick, there you weird. go. Flesh-toned Marauder. Oh, that is cursed. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> what do you but think, Chad? Fl um, Flesh-toned Marauder. Who loves it? That or, might be worse than the Black Marauder. You know, it could be worse <laughs> if it were like a Locust and it had a uh, dongle gun down here. Is it too late to change the branding <laughs> from lion -O to Oscar Mayer? Yes. Oh no no that that's not that's not Lion-O. Oh I wish I had an Oscar Mayer meat Mac. <laughs> uh, that 
choose. Oh my to gosh! Instead with of the things. Wiener Mobile, you, you could have a Wiener Mac. No, that's just it. Instead of the Wiener Mobile, you have the Meat Mac. Yes, Meat Mac, and it drives up for deliveries, and you pay your money, and it shoots hot dogs at you out of its cannons. Yeah, it's just like an AT twenty hot dog thunk. And the I'm lasers, back. the lasers spray condiments. Yes, the condiment lasers, as are found throughout the inner sphere. I hate this. Back. <laughs> I'm back, back, and I am I am eating large steak. Excellent. And scallop Pleasure large potatoes. steak purchased from the Meat Mac. Cookie has made the correct choice. I'm just eating an almond joy. Um, <laughs> but can you imagine? Okay, just just for the sake of argument. Imagine the clan shows up in the invasion on the planet where the Oscar Mayer meat mech is doing deliveries. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, oh, I have a batch all. And the guy's like, well, I, I, I guess. And he steps up and he goes to, he steps up to him and then he just starts shooting hot dogs and the, the clan is like, what, what are, I bid size of this? beef. And then here comes, here comes the ketchup and it squirts all over. So, I haven't even fired yet. You're not supposed to bleed on me. And then the sugar starts crystallizing and he gets ants in the cockpit. <laughs> not the Do you bees. want ants? Not the bees. Jeez. Do you want ants? Because this is how you get ants. <laughs> oh, God, but it's the periphery. So they're like ants that are a planet wide problem and they will just straight up eat the leg off a of Mac. Like Wynigan and the ants are like red ants that are nasty and yeah. Oh, Except like Indiana been Jonesville uh, ants, huge, huge, huge. Digi Digiman, by the way, is correct. It needs to be a Hebrew national. There needs to be a Hebrew national mech as well, so they'll taste better. Oh yes, that's what they were there on the planet for. It was a meat versus meat meat slapping festival. It's big meaty mech slapping meat. Let's get to let's get the meme right here. Oh, wow, yes. this is mechanized meat slap. That's a wrestling things. meme. I just made into a battle tech meme. Thanks, the mechanized meat mashup. <laughs> okay, let's see. Big meaty mix slapping meat. Yes. Mechanically separated you meat. Know, I feel like the meat mech would have to be a fire starter. I feel like the fire starter would have to be the ref. <sighs> hey, either way, we're agreed. There is a fire starter there. Yes. Definitely. There has to be. There's no question. Uh, but, should there be a hatchet man at the barbecue pit? Oh, well, the the hatchet man is the, the apprentice to the axe man who's doing the big cuts. No, the here's, hatchet here's the, the thing. small ones. Here's the thing. It's it's a showdown of, of styles of cooking. So you've got your average, uh, you, you've got your stuff over here, like you've got your cattle master that's making brisket and that kind of thing, but... And, you know, clearly there's a, there's a Zeus that's making, like, sausage. I mean, I'm, I'm with you, I'm with you. And I realize we're shitposting MechWarrior, but I'm pretty sure everything we've just said was at least one legitimate pro, uh, plot point in one of the Gundam series. I have zero doubt by the that way, it was in G Gundam. By the way, <laughs> Fezbear, uh, Fezbear has hit it correctly. You dare refuse my grill, chawl. Uh, and you get now, you now refuse here's the my thing. bitch in here, the name of Karinsky. What is going on here? Now, I will baste you, for I am a master at it. Why are you laughing? Stop laughing. This isn't funny. Now here's the other thing though, like I've rattled all this off so far, but you 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 glossed over something. And that is the Hatamato Chi over here that's doing hibachi. Oh, could we get a uh, hatchet man with a flamethrower arm to do hibachi? No, it needs a the, hat. I mean, that's that's what the that's what the Hatamato is here for. I mean, can arguably, we just have hibachi fight where they fight in a volcano? Yes. Wait a minute. Why are we not? Is there a reason why it wouldn't be a dragon? Hot dog uh, I hibachi hoedown. I was going with Hatamato Chi because it's even more Japanese. Oh, okay. And there's the nothing Shogun. more Japanese than the throwing Shogun. a hot dog into a volcano with a robot. The Shogun also, was a Terran hegemony mech. Also, Carr is correct. The Steiner uh, Sausage Scouts. Mm. Wow. No, that is that name does not need to be used because that is that is a video <laughs> that was filmed on Canopus is what that was. <laughs> it's a whole series. Uh, uh, Steiner Schnitzel Squad. <laughs> 
dun 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 See, that then, right there, that is something that could be clipped for blackmail. <laughs> for and T28 also says, um, uh, you know those ghost bear elementals, you know they had a, an elemental grade tailgate. I'm with that. <laughs> for safety reasons, please do not attempt to bone the meat mac. Welcome to Canopus. Get your dick if, out of that. Move on. Okay, so ghost bear loving American football. Does that mean that their uniforms use like the Chicago livery on it? No. Unfortunately, they're blue with one big white star in the middle. Oh, they're no. Boys! Yeah. Uh, we gotta write a book and fix this. Wait, how about we can have Space Chicago? How about them cowboys? How about no? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a sports ball person, but that is one thing I will do is I will cheer on anybody who plays the Cowboys. Wait, so you're saying we could defeat the clans by offering them two oh. NFL franchises. Okay, Owl's gonna correct you there. He says that's not what the shirts show. Oh. It is if you replace the shirts. <laughs> <clears throat> what do they have, Cookie? I don't know. Wookie, what do they got? No, I don't remember. I, I've worn the shirt like once. So I'm sitting here thinking, if the ghost bear used the cowboy uniform, is Jerry Jones still around at that point? Yes. I do not know what a Jerry Jones is, but I feel like they would pilot He's... the meat mech with great honor. Jerry Jones is the lich that owns the cowboys. <laughs> ah, they could have a nuclear phylactery. Nuclear phylactery installed in the gentleman's appendage I just, to maintain the meat theme. I just want to throw out here real quick: if we have any dungeon masters in the audience, uh, don't don't do nuclear phylactery, okay? Just... Or definitely do it. It's a good plan with no downside. I am remembering we had this conversation at some point. Is that what's your phylactery? It's like a rock. Where is it? In the middle of a pile of rocks. Yeah, I think and my I favorite take on cooking. that was uh, like. What, What's your phylactery? Yes, it is the record on the Voyager spacecraft. Get <laughs> fucked. <laughs> Ghost bears are the Vikings. The Minnesota Vi Okay, so they're purple and gold. I guess they're Merit Guard. Hmm. Ghost like bears are like their football. You want to know exactly what the ghost bears aren't like? Yes. Real bears. Honolulu blue and silver. I'm unfortunately not getting the reference. Lions. Oh, you're definitely not wrong there. Rough. The Rough. amusing thing for me about the phylactery discussion is always that people forget that there is a minimum size to a phylactery because the idea of someone being like, oh, I'll just make it a... a, a you know, a, a copper and put it in circulation. It's like, but that's too small. It doesn't work. I have a solution to this conundrum. But also first, let me pause to say, Ro, you listening? Or are you listening? Or Ro, are you listening? Ro, you listening? Hi. Hello. Thank you. And welcome for subscribing to Tier 2. <laughs> also, I think the phylactery should be the entire castle that the king lives in given tax-free, and now if the heroes wish to destroy the Lich, they must become national you know enemies I, and purchase a catapult. You know what I like even more than that? What's your phylactery? Well, it happens to be the dam that's holding back this lake above the village. Interesting theory, <laughs> but I feel it lacks vision. What is your phylactery? Just stares downwards at the planet. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's like um, Ego, or what's his name? You are correct. You, you got it in one. If you go by d d rules, it takes a long... The, the bigger it is, the longer it takes to create. There are Do liches. not worry, as a lich, you will have much spare time. You well, can you gotta, use it you to browse finish the home shopping network. You, become, you gotta finish it before you become the lich. Yeah, but then you can change your phylactery after you become a lich. Are you sure? No. But I think if you're going to make stuff up, so am I. 
Question. Look, okay. Look. Question. <laughs> Question. As a lich, as a lich, does it have to be a singular object that you create to become your phylactery, or can it be uh, like a uh, a small group of objects? I think it has got to be, be one because because you can't break up your soul and store it in separate things. You're not Voldemort. <clears throat> Why not? You can download more. Well, there you the, go. The, the, the rule, there you go, it's, the, it's the phylactery rules because it you read the next to him. Okay, and no, if it's I, all split up, then you, the body can't reform. No, I was just curious because uh, I'd uh, create a home shopping network and then sell small parts. Here's what I would do: so that they could never actually gather them all together in one place and then kill me. Here's, here's what I might do: is I might create like. A, a holy icon and then use that and then gift it to a church. And when the holy water starts bubbling, they start looking for what's causing no, it. it. I mean, who's ever going to suspect? All right, Sarbak, have a great night, dude. Thank you for being here with us. Uh, Grimo have says... Have fun out there. Uh... I'm going to I'm going to let Squick read that. Uh and then I'm going to try to put paint on. Oh, oh, by the way, real quick, I wanted to say this. Um I don't know how many of you follow uh the Army Painter on YouTube. Okay? I'm I'm throwing this out there. I imagine Warlax already knows this, but I'm going to say it anyway. So, I have I I'm subbed to the Army Painter on YouTube because they're actually talking about shit they're going to be doing soon. They have recently put together a development team for their uh their their speed paints moving forward. So, they've got like six people, I think, that they put together that are going to each individually develop 10 paints and these these are like four of them are like YouTubers that you've probably heard of. Um, I know Dana Howell, uh, Ninjon, and uh, Brent from Goobertown are all in this. And Markiplier's they're... making paint? What? Markiplier's, yeah, Markiplier's making, making paint. And uh, Linus Tech Tips and, uh, and Logan Paul, they're all making ten paints. Um, so <laughs> you guys are horrible. We are, but I blame him. But, uh, let's see. They're going to do this, and they're they're going to take the line of what is currently 24 speed paints up to 90, which is a fucking oh, nice. lot. But more importantly than that, they're already doing this on the existing speed, because it's going to be a while before they come out with that shit, right? Because like that's going to be in January. They're going to start the development. Speed on, paint wave two! God, it's going to be a big fucking wave two, but the other thing is that their speed paint in their ne I think it's in their next batch. They weren't entirely clear on this, but in their next batch moving forward, they have changed the resin medium that's in these, so it will no longer reactivate. Oh! Yay! So, for anyone that was wondering, there's that. And I learned this, and I thought y'all should know. So, eventually, Viejo... Well, I mean, they, they, they need to do that because Vallejo is coming out their uh, line of speed paints. With their express paints that I am assured will be released at fucking some point. From a squirt gun loaded with a bucket. That's it. I'm looking forward <laughs> I'm looking forward to them Valley Joe paints coming out. Yes, then you can paint the hot dog mech more accurately. Oh, Indeed. Uh, you know, I am suddenly... Oh shit, where is that? Where's... I have to look this up now. Shit. Ah, concerning. I have caused problems. You, Very good well, one point for no, me. I just remembered something, and now I have to move stuff around so I can actually reach, you know, my computer interface devices. Uh, May you have good luck doing the clicky clicks. Clickety clackety clickety with my very, very loud. Uh, I'm surprised you all didn't make comments when I was typing things. <laughs> Anyway, going back to chat for a moment while we have the downtime. Indeed. My phylactery? Oh, that thing. Oh, you crossed it to get into this part of the valley. Yeah, Soul Bridge is my phylactery. I forget why I made it the only bridge for this part of the nation, but I think it had something to do with my dad? I worked on the thing, so hell if I can remember. Mm, yes. Oh, man, where is that? Concerning. Then, oh, then Morgan with the very cursed, buy my NFT phylactery. 
Oh, you know man. what? I'm forming. I'm forming a party to go hunt that thing down and destroy it, just based off that line. Yeah. Good luck. I mean, they're just going to download more liches. Yeah. <laughs> download more lich dot com. <laughs> I've, I've got. I've got some servers to smash now. Understandable. Good luck. Somebody hash a uh, pling joke, please. Just in case. There you go. Yes. Okay. I'm almost there now. Almost. Yeah, do you ever have a Stay moment where it's like, yes, Stay my human target. eyeballs have read these words, but then your brain is like, yeah, those were some interesting words. We're going to ignore them and put our own in there. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I just read that whole thing from Lord Grimos. It's like, ah, yes, a quote from <coughs> Daiso, my hill dwarf lich, whose whole desire is for human teeth. And it's like, no, no, I go back, I read it. It's, desire is to teach people, not human teeth. Those are very different. Okay, okay, I'm going to drop this in chat so everyone has to see this. I just remembered this is a thing. I don't own this STL. I will remedy that yes. at some point. Okay, it's in chat. It's in chat. Now you all have to bear witness. I have a number of concerns, but also a mighty need. Also, is the hot it's... dog butthole a jump jet? You decide. It's beautiful. I'm waiting on cooking. I'm okay, game. I, I, I love that the arms and legs are relish green. Ah. There you go, guys. <laughs> I see. <laughs> the meat mac grows. Ina witness, says the lore master. Wait. <laughs> does the lore master know of the meat? Oh, I'm yes, trying to figure out where to actually buy this fucking thing. From the oh, internet. There it, is. there it is. Okay, here we go. I've even got a link for it now. Download Assuming more meat. <laughs> Car is 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 objecting. <laughs> this this is what you get for threatening me. Car, yeah. hear me out. It is not technically bringing the cursed object into the house. It is constructing it there. <laughs> I, I am afraid that the website for this is gone. No, oh, no. I need this one. I shall search the intertube, interweb, internet. Well, the link that I dropped in here was actually where the original person had posted it. So, there we go. Hey, we go. Toilet Obliterator, thank you for gifting a sub to Volcanic Abe. You have gifted 57 subs in this channel, sir. That is impressive, and thank you very much. I keep telling you people to stop throwing money at us, and you keep doing it. Stop, like, don't do the highlighting thing again. Do you remember that night? Do you remember that night where we just got nothing but mm -hmm. people highlighting oh. the oh. fuck out of stuff? And the Grimos, girls came in Grimos fucking is like, fudge off. He's he's oh. being very... He's, oh. he's letting you know, fudge off. He can He's going to spend money if he wants to. No. Grimos, Grimos is working pale blue tonight. <laughs> <laughs> no, but John, no. John says, no pennies. And you we're getting pennies to the head all oh, night long. Damn which it. you did. <laughs> can you imagine? Can you yes. imagine the traffic if if you were to advertise beforehand that Meat Mech is coming? <laughs> and you announce that is a very unfortunate three, choice of keywords. In three weeks. Oh God. <laughs> meat, meat oh God. Mech. I found something so much worse. Uh, I'm not know. sure I want to know. I need words for this now i you most assuredly do not wish to know it, it is the reverse of ocular enjoyment and it now curses my brain that's where it why attempts i said to words live rent free that's why i said words the words cannot describe i don't want the visual i want the words it is an eldritch horror yes uh bubba j is is at location redacted fez oh i didn't realize that's where mad ducks was tonight yeah yep. Yes, at the event, redacted, location, redacted, humans redacted. I have redacted the planet. Oh, the car, I will now send you the most cursed thing I have found. 
Do not. So, so, so wait, instead of hack the planet, you're redact the planet? Redact yep. the planet. <laughs> planet Earth, redact the ultimate the SCP. Planet. How's I the think car? That's Before I send thing. this to you, do you desire hot dog condiment penis American flag with testicles? <laughs> that would no. be a pretty big no. <laughs> Hard Are you sure it is available? Pass. Why must you always find the most? There does not need to be. World. Look, how can I best put this? No, that's the how you. I've encountered you enough no. enough bad in my life that that is something I could do without. Hi, I. I sorry you wandered in here. <laughs> Understandable. Instead of the American flag, they appear to also have a flag, which is the flag of Texas based on the size of the hat. I mean, to be fair, <laughs> I, I kind of believe that one. Yeah. Uh, I have been warned I should not mess with Texas. You know, all my exes live in Texas. Is that why you hang your hat in Tennessee? He's yeah, in the heart yeah. of Texas. Yeah, I, I've asked people. Who who lived in the middle of nowhere, Texas? Are the stars at night really big and bright? Yeah. Clap, 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 clap. Yes. And half of them clap at me, and the other half Glower. give me give me this cold, dead stare. You know what's deep in the heart of Texas? San Antonio. You know what else? Austin. You know what else? Fucking nothing! I am guessing also at least one Walmart. No, it's an H-E-B. Oh, is that the large gas station that has an underground complex that goes that's on bodies. for 13 miles? That's oh, bodies. my God. Oh, God. Squick. Okay. I, uh, squick. I, uh... I have to share this because I recently encountered a wonderful little skit video of the weird kid comes over to visit I your kid this. too early. Oh, that's a nice shirt. Yeah, it's from Bussies. No, I think that place is pronounced Bucky's. No, it's Bussy's. My dad talks about Bussy all the time. I've been there. Oh, uh, that is not concerning at all. Uh, right. Uh, I'm sure that Cookie has kids in her class that talk about we went on a few, we went on a vacation when we went to Bucky's because apparently it's a fucking destination. God, apparently I do need to use the sleep. Actually, no, they all here. go. They all go, most of them go the other way. Oh, well, I mean, that's a good choice. I'm, I'm just yeah. saying, I read Brain Dead Guru's last comment as, yeah, it's minty dollar genitals. <laughs> I was not prepared for that. So thanks, Brain. Abe, I'm, I'm heartened to tell you that uh, Bucky's is expanding. There's two in Kentucky now. They're Into fixing. the minty genitals market? I think they're fixing to be three. Excuse me. Um, so, uh, yes. yeah, I don't know. I was going to say something and then it ran away. So Understandable. I I was telling you all at the beginning of the show, show that um, I spent my evening with uh, four, 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 five, and six-year-olds, three, four, five, and six-year-olds, um, doing all things pumpkin. I am pumpkined out right now because, at least for a few minutes. Because um, we were doing a pumpkin palooza, and Wookie got to help uh, load load up three big trucks of pumpkins from the local grocery store. So we got to have all the pumpkins at our school. So folks got to take pumpkins home. I'm sure they're thrilled to have that on November third. <laughs> well, hey, it's about to be Thanksgiving, so they can you know they can chunk it or they can. I mean, assuming they're the pie pumpkins. pumpkins. Now your pumpkin too well, can be loaded into a pumpkins, catapult some for of them flavor. Are gourds, some of them are, you know, this yeah. Is, it was a the... lot of pumpkins. Oh, it was yeah. a lot of pumpkins. Yeah, I can too. It is almost eggnog season. I am going to fill so many of my organs with the sugar milk. Candied milk you... season. Oh no, the candied milk is much different in a number also, of key respects. It's, it's also decorative gourd season. It is motherfucking decorative gourd season. Abe has uh, alcoholic eggnog aging in the fridge. Well, yes. Oh, tried making pumpkin pie out of a jack-o'-lantern pumpkin. Yeah, actually, I have heard that pumpkin pack is 
three-quarters squash with a little bit of pumpkin in it. Actually, as it turns out, uh, according to the Food and Drug Administration, uh, there's not really... They can... Uh, food manufacturers can get away with just using butternut squash and pumpkin puree, and they can call it pumpkin, because apparently it's just not that different. Mm -hmm. But yes, as yep. a fellow enjoyer of the Pacific Northwest, I have no idea what these giant gas stations are all about, except that I want to visit one because they're weird and they have a meat department uh, in a gas station. Law, I want to tell you this. Um, there are Bucky's, like, obviously this thing started in Texas, and there are, you know, a fucking lot of them, right? They're always packed. It doesn't matter what, like, the ones right in fucking Houston are always packed fucking packed always and if you want to go in and get moderately decent brisket you can go right ahead yeah that's the other thing we don't have like a drive through brisketarium in the pacific northwest and this i'm disappointed true. by that a brisketarium I mean, my my uh my favorite brisket that i can get locally is from a practically no name shack that's about a mile up the road from me it's just like it's literally a trailer in out of which they serve brisket through a window. I Brisketarium. Want window brisket. I want to keep that word forever. <laughs> you are welcome you, to it. Congratulations. It is your work. Cookie, you need a new what? tattoo. <laughs> I no, I don't want it that much. I'm just uh, going to use it. Please do not it. label any portion of the like... human body the brisketarium. I it would be PhD concerning. I have in brisketology. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, I want window brisket. The only brisket I've ever had was when I was working at Microsoft as a vendor, and they had their cafeterias, and this was in the before time, TM. And, like, once a month, uh, one of the cafeteria places would just have really good brisket. And it's like, hello, I would like the brisket, please. And they were like, yes, but also give us money. I'm like, okay, cool, that seems reasonable because this is a cafeteria and that's how they work. So I would give them money and I would get delicious brisket meat and then I would eat the delicious brisket meat and then I was happy. But now I don't work there anymore because they stopped making the brisket. That I mean, might be unrelated. I was going to say, how much do these have to do with each other? Wenchbane, Wenchbane, I I'm not a chef myself, but I would say brisket is right up there. What's that? Um, uh, oh, uh, bar -table. Bar -table. Okay, okay. Um, I'm also not a chef, but I do want to say, I do want to say that as a person that makes a fair bit of barbecue, uh, brisket is amazing. I think I prefer pulled pork. <laughs> not, me. not me. I am not from Texas. I get to say that. The only time I've had pulled pork that I can remember that it was like memorably good was also the time I got my sandwich stolen by a pack of dachshunds. I suppose, <laughs> I suppose Brain I'll Dead, just... Brain Dead, you want a real panadera? Yes, come to New Mexico. Then, then, then you can, you know, then you'll get the right bizcochos, etc., and get the right stuff. Now, I do want to preface what I'm saying with one very important fact. I am saying I prefer pulled pork because compared to brisket, it takes half the time to make. You go. That makes sense. Because, like, like, if I'm making brisket, I have so done you... it a few times where it's really fucking good. It also took 20 hours. So what you're saying is that you prefer brisket uh, as a flavor-wise, however convenience-wise, you prefer pulled pork. Oh, no, pork. there's nothing convenient about the pulled pork. That's 8 to 12 hours also. But it's Wait, still less Do they make, like, a mechanical time. brisket hyzer? Every day we drift further and further from God. Look, I just want to know if there's a machine I can put in my backyard and, like, shove meat into and then get tastier meat out the other side. Yes, yes it's called a smoker. It's Well, like, specifically what he's asking is, like, what is the lowest effort way I can do this? And the answer to that is a pellet smoker that's going to cost you, Wait, like, four grand. is there something grand. I can subscribe to? Can I subscribe to meat? Uh, you can I mean, subscribe to... You could go to the grocery Arby's. store. There are a couple uh, meat, for... meat subscriptions. Omaha and Good, Good. what's that, Good? I don't know. Anyway, there's a couple of them that are... Okay, so... anyway, here's uh, here's Lion of Thunderbolt. I hope you're all happy. I ooh, am. Ooh, I need Butcher to see. Box, there's another one. Yeah, Butcher Box. Are those red highlights? 
Uh, oh lasers. yeah, those are lasers. They he had to have lasers. Yeah, no, I guess I haven't that's... finished his visor yet. Let's make the visor red. Okay. As as my children say, those are red pewers. This is true. Mm. Pew 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 pew. Is my my son? Remind me, say, how old are you? How do your kids how? For the moment, four and five. Tomorrow uh -huh. it will be four and six. Nice. Happy birthday to the older one then. Yes. The hopefully, he's, hopefully he's feeling better at this point. Oh, eldest is feeling better. Uh, and now youngest, youngest is uh, projectile vomit boy. Briefly. Briefly? Briefly. Yes. That's what we're Briefly. doing. Briefly. For only a stretch of about two hours did he have a superpower. I have almost convinced my son that when he was born, we don't have any pictures of him like the day after he was born or like the hour after he was born because he went straight into the NICU. But... Uh, Poor thing. Yeah, he was... It, it, whatever. It was a thing. He's, he's all right at this point. In any event, right. I have almost convinced him the reason we don't have any pictures of him from that point is because the doctors were busy putting in his robot parts. Oh, my and goodness. He's not sure he believes me, but he might. Like, he's is, still is trying Carr to Is aware of this? He's yes. going to get... He's going to get to be like a teenager and be like, no, Dad, I can do this. I have robot parts. You told me. Yeah. Watch out. Watch out. And it's going to be something stupid like jumping off a roof. And you had to I tell can't. him that you couldn't afford the good robot parts. You had to get the porcelain ones. <laughs> the porcelain robot bits. Yes, because he looked at us and said, be boop. Yeah. yeah that actually do happened. not worry. Wait. They are very affordable. Like, what, I, do, you, I, do you not say beep boop? No, no. Like, his response to me telling him he had robot parts was beep boop. Understandable. Because my son has comedic fucking timing. Fair. Fair, car kicks. I, I repent. My bad. <laughs> Don't you put that evil on me, Ricky Bobby. <laughs> Do you know how many notes I'm taking right now? Is it seven? <laughs> Don't worry. Seven I'm whole notes? Six. He's making a scale. <laughs> he's making a scale. He has seven notes. He's gonna. Now he's going to sing something. I wonder. No, I la, 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 la. Just, just so I, we're clear, I can't read music. I just notes. kind of sing it stuff. Just, just so we're clear, a scale is an octave. An octave is eight notes. No, oh. it's seven notes because there's the one on either side. I know what me I know my music. Today it I learned I have a bathroom octave. <laughs> what? Because it's like C, it's C to C. Yeah, that's eight notes. Yeah, it's it's eight notes, but you can't. You don't. It's like the week. You don't count the the Saturday uh, that yeah, you're counting. Both the C and the C are in the scale. They're both there. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway, theory theory discussions by by us oh. apparently. Okay, so, now I need to paint something else because that only took like half an hour. Um, so I was unable to locate the standardized combat hot dog robot, but Damn. I found an inferior substitute on Reddit and posted it into the Discord. Oh no! This, this is robot true. is I'm very a, good at I hot just, dog manufacturing. I just want to make the point: uh, my son does regularly scare the ever living shit out of us on a fairly regular basis. Like the time he pulled a 20-pound hand weight onto his head. Bold decision. Uh, it's I mean, a hand weight, not a head weight. You should tell him that. Uh, anyway. Other thing to paint. What other thing shall I paint? I have primed here. Well, you're not going to paint my director Krennig, so... No, I went to the I internet. I... <laughs> That's an interesting opener. I need to step away for a bit, and I will be back probably. So I will... Alrighty. Guys, Cookie may or may not be back. Have fun, be well. But I'm reading here, and apparently the key to cooking brisket is to cook it low and slow. Yes, and between... I want the opposite of that. No, fuck that. I want microwave five-minute brisket. Then get prepared to chew on rubber. Okay, wasn't I'm fine the, with that. I like meat gum. Give me the hard jerky brisket food. It's not wasn't there be a jerky. joke about that on the BPL podcast about microwave steak? Yeah, probably. Look, I can... Hmm, I do own a microwave and many dollars that can be exchanged at the dollar store for regrettable decisions. I hate everything about this conversation. And also a small cast iron pan. Only slightly cracked on one side. Everything about this conversation. I hate all of it. 
Yes, it is very cursed. Uh, the the point was made that when Para's uh, male child plays tabletop, he's he's going to be Mechanus. I'm thinking he's, we're going to get a comb version too, and feed the birds. I have no idea what the fuck. Vectron, yeah, yeah, thank you, yeah. thank you for being with us. Yeah. Many birds will be fed on this day. Yes, unfortunately, they're going to be fed in amphetamines. <laughs> dope. And just, and just dope. Birds. <laughs> oh my god. Greg Locks so, a bird. Here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to. If I don't know how many viewers we have here that would not have watched it since we mentioned it earlier, but the uh, Magistrate and Mundanus podcast episodes are wonderful entertainment. Oh yes, you your brain should. needs to require them. You should you should seek them out and enjoy them. That's right, the BPL podcast, the number one podcast that is BPL, because fuck Berkeley. There it is. I have been to Berkeley. They have a very nice hat store. But how's their public library? Apparently it was triple as... parked. I did not go. Inferior is what I'm hearing. So now we're going to paint this legally distinct for more hammer work. So here's what I'm doing. I'm putting down a thin layer of absolution green. I don't know why the color is absolution green, but we're going to let that get into That's, the reset. That sounds like that sounds like salamander space marine green. It's darker than that. It's really dark. Like it's if you use it undiluted, it's almost black. Like I said, salamander space marine green. Get more likes. Nope. Oh, I have found additional curses to share. Oh, no. The Discord will remain unsafe for everyone. <laughs> well, at least he's not dropping in chat and cursing them, too. Oh, I have that option as well. Chat, do you desire the cursing? It is no American flag hot dog condiment penis with testicles. Let's, yeah, but let's it is not, very let's cursed. Let's not put chat through that one. I'm pretty sure that's against Twitch TOS. I believe it is allowed if it is... Backed by money. No. No. Understandable. No. Instead, I offer the standard cursing. Oh, man. First bullshit. It's not of this earth. I don't Spend know that I want to click that. Oh, oh, oh. I'm worried I'm about curiosity. Jesus, dude, I didn't you. expect anybody was going to get that reference from a, like... Newgrounds video I watched 20 years ago. What? The space people reference. We have all aged 20 years in the space of 20 rotations around the sun. This is true. Well, Thank you, Squid. I am surprisingly helpful. This is true. Some days. Go. Let's Space see. asshole. Oh. <laughs> well, I, I think uh, Bully Snake is more artist. Hands are hard. AI, watch this. Shit. <laughs> and the AI Rob Liefeld's says... like, like small, intricate body parts are difficult. I'm going to have everybody carry big guns and stand behind slight rises. Hal, have you seen AI-generated hands? Because it's a fucking oh, yes. nightmare. Oh, yes. It is a uh, the, hey, yeah, Total nightmare. Obliterator, thank you for the sub to Kendall VR. Uh, you are on the ball. Football. Basketball. Uh, I mean... That being, is better than a number of other options. Being a it Kentuckian, is. I'm willing to accept this. That's, yes. Interestingly enough, apparently we're supposed to like football now too. Well, apparently this season has not gone done much to reinforce that. So I know Said very little of the to. footed ball. Ah, I understand but... it is oblong for reasons related to complications. Ah, but it's quick. You're going to need to learn a bit more about the football, and I have just the person for you to be looking up. I am now deeply concerned. John Madden. There it is. 
say the purpose of the, what you're trying to do is get the ball down the field and score more points than the other team. Boom. Not only do you need to score more points, but you need to do it before the time runs out. Otherwise, you're going to have a bad time. And with only four quarters to a game, you got to work fast. Unless, like, of course, boom, you can stall it into overtime where you get a few minutes more to get down the field. You got to do the thing like the Tanakhtan when you do it with the fast. Why is my John Madden Boomhauer in a different tone? <laughs> because I think no. you've only got Boomhauer as an impression to use. Hey, man, I want to tell you what, man. I'm going to do the thing up and there. I'm going to move that football on down the field, man. Score them points, win that game, man. I'm going to tell you what. An excellent point, and I haven't seen field running like that since the start of the game when that man ran down the field. <laughs> I've returned also to two stories about football, and, uh... Durberger has and Owl have points. Which which football? I like I like the other football just because uh that's just the way I am and that's what I grew up with. So Oh I like the one with the bean bag that you see at college. Hacky sack? Yeah, that's the good football. <clears throat> I mean you see, I, under normal circumstances, I'd also say soccer, but like I had an entire season of watching my son not pay any fucking attention to the ball and have to have a coach stand in front of him so he didn't get hit by it. So like, I'm not, I'm you trying like not to, out. I, I'm, I'm not going to pay attention to. So I played 14 seasons of soccer when I was in school. I can't do this anymore. Hello, Digiman. So. Uh, so, Durberger, I apologize for this comment, but I really, really hope that your team does not win the World Series for reasons other than baseball. They have a That's World all I'm Series saying. Wait, wait, wait. Football? Which, which team? Which team? Which team? Philly. The World, the World okay, Series right no. now is the Phillies Fuck and the, the Astros. Astros. Fuck the Astros. The trash. Astros. Yes, but... To? Yes, but gentlemen, gentlemen, there is a meme going around that um, explains my point uh, that um, every time the Phillies have won, it has been a, an absolutely horrible year for the world. Like 1929. The Phillies, the Phillies won thing. in 2020? <clears throat> <laughs> oh. No, but it's not... But, but the... But you know what I mean? It's it's things like 1929, etc. Yeah, but fuck the Astros. I mean, come on. It's just... I really don't know how much more awful years you, I can take you know, right now. You, you know what? Uh, I have a great answer to this. Because um, growing up in my house, college football was... Uh, th Religion. There was... There was a certain set of rules. You root for Michigan all the time. Yeah. You root for Michigan State when they're not playing Michigan. Yeah. You root for whoever plays against Notre Dame. This is right. all sounding very familiar, but make it basketball, and I'll get into it after you're done. Okay. And uh, I have added to that root uh, also against whoever is playing Ohio State, unless it is Notre Dame, in which case. V root for a meteor. Okay, this uh -huh. all choose to mentally familiar. replace all of this rooting with the Australian so, sense. So, uh, very simply put, um, what you what you both are saying is that fuck both of the teams in the World Series. So you're rooting for a meteor, sweet meteor of death. Yes. <laughs> um. So that was true also in my household, except it was you root for uh, K State and and Kansas State. And you especially root for anyone playing against the Jayhawks, and you, um, yeah, etc. Because okay. both my parents yeah. went to K State. Okay, so here's the Kentucky basketball version of this. Yep. You root for Kentucky. Yep. Always. You, yep. If it's in the SEC, if it's in the SEC, and Kentucky's not in the game, you root against Tennessee. Okay. If it's out, if it's not a uh, if it's not a conference game, you root for the SEC team. I forgot one. Anybody playing the Braves? Okay, that's fair. But then also, fuck Duke and yep. fuck the Tar Heels. Really, more Duke. 
but just generally, especially fuck Duke. Like, oh just, yeah, especially. Uh, like, like I know that the, especially fuck this team. Like, oh yeah. Like I know that the ESPN twenty for twenty documentary now is several years old, but I want to make this abundantly clear for chat. I like it is twenty twenty two. I still hate Christian Leitner. Yup. He's a dick, and he got to play on the dream team, and he didn't Car's deserve right there it. with you. Car's right there with you. She had it all typed out just yeah. as yep. you said it. <laughs> that's that's because that's because she knows. That's because she also still hates Christian. Because because it's now Christian Leitner. Now I'm fucking mad. Here, right, let's here, talk about something here, else. We can help you. We can help you with this. Okay, are you prepared for us to help you not be mad about Duke anymore? Uh, I think Coach K retired, didn't he? He did. Okay, um, so. but we can help, and he lost his last home game too. But okay, good. Fuck him. Something and to help you not be mad about Duke anymore. Are you what? prepared? What you got? So, do you see that Thunderbolt you just finished? I do. The lion that, right in there. That uh, yeah, that Thundercats one. Yeah. There is a forty percent chance it does not have a dick toaster in it. I'm not sure. The toaster is there for security, not your personal enjoyment. Please resume wearing your pants. I'm sorry. If 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 Mad Ducks were here, he would he would tell you that it's the the patented Richard Toaster security system. Nah, I'm not doing that. Sorry, (laughs) I have family members. I have family members. It is biometric. It is unfortunately. Where it's, it's like the difference no. between using the brand name for Kleenex or saying tissues. The Richard Toaster is the high end brand name. Uh, I, here I I can I can help with this hating of Duke because there is another team from your uh, from the state of Kentucky that I have heard that Kentuckians ate. Okay, okay, okay. I have to tell this story. How's the car? You don't get to tell this story. This is my story. I'm oh. telling this story. Hold on, hold on. Can I finish? You can finish, no. but I can have I a finish? story. Can I finish? Shut up. He's telling Look. a story, then I'm going to tell a story. Uh, all I have to say is one word, and it will anger you. Louisville. He said it right. He did at least say it He did say, say it, right. it right. That's That's actually true. You said it correctly. Yes, I know. My dad came from Kentucky. What do you want from me? <laughs> I don't know. US dollars. I have just... actually had to educate people on this. Yeah. I've had arguments with people about that. No, it's Louisville. It, it is, is Louisville. 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 Now, okay, so here, here's my Louisville story. No, it's oh, Louisville. Fuck Shut you. the fuck up. Okay, so here's the story. It's like not people calling it New Orleans, and you're like, dude. Get out of here. It's Nolans. Uh, okay, so so here is my Louisville and Kentucky basketball story. I have heard people talk about college sports rivalries in Texas and other places, right? It's like, oh, UT and A&M, they really go at, like, UT and A&M are in the same conference for the first time in 20 years. Get the fuck out. Doesn't matter. <laughs> okay. This is how strong the University of Louisville, University of Kentucky rivalry is, okay? When I see news stories about two 85-year-old men in a dialysis clinic in Frankfurt, halfway between Lexington and Louisville, yeah. they get into a fist fight in the waiting room over basketball, Yep, that's the level of rivalry between these that schools. sounds like that sounds yep. like K State and K that sounds like K State and Kansas. Yep. That's the kind of that's the kind of crap they do too. Ah yes, fist ball. Fist ball. You must fist it for the brisket. Oh gosh. That's like chess boxing. I love it. Phrasing. <laughs> yes, we shall elbow drop opposing team from the goalpost. You gotta understand. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If you're gonna be the are cream you, and the are, crop. Are, you climb to the top to drop that elbow. You I'm, gotta make I'm sure sorry. that I'm you... suddenly, I'm suddenly thinking that Squick is perhaps a University of Tennessee fan, and he just saw them beat Alabama in Knoxville because he just what? tore down Listen. the goalpost and threw him in the fucking Tennessee River. <laughs> Listen, I'll be cool with that because I just hate Alabama. <laughs> I have no SEC. idea what most of these places are. Welcome to the SEC. 
the the only thing worse than Alabama is Ohio State because Ohio State doesn't have to play anyone worth the shit and are still within the top three of the uh, NCAA ratings every year. And you know, we Ohio still. State are really good. Who have you played this year? A couple of high school teams. Yeah, that's, exactly. That's right. It's like, I, I love seeing Texas come in to the SEC thinking, oh, yeah, we're a Big Ten school. We're going to come in and be fucking great. You know what they did? They got their asses kicked probably uh, can, by LSU, can I, let's be honest. Can, can I respond with the fact that Texas was not a Big Ten team? Were they not? No, Texas is not in the Big Ten. Well, they're but never they're in the SEC does possess now. the number 10, and because it is Texas, it is very large. Okay. Okay, like the only Big Ten team I'm behind in the slightest is Iowa. Fuck you. <laughs> For what it's worth, it's only because of family reasons. University of Michigan and uh, Michigan State University are both Big Ten teams. Yeah, I know, and I don't have any bad feelings against the Spartans, but like the, the Wolverines just don't play into my calculus at all. Like I'd, I'd sooner root for the, uh, the the Spartans. Sorry. No, that's okay. It's just you said that the only ones that you cared about at all was, was Iowa, and it's like mm, this is the incorrect answer. <laughs> Wait, is that the ones with the face paint and anger issues, or the ones with the green armor that punch the moon? Uh, both. Okay. okay. Yes, both. <laughs> so uh, Iowa is uh, yellow and black Hawkeyes, as opposed to Wolverines or Spartans. Yes, and you you want to know why um, you shouldn't want to vote for or root for uh, the the Hawkeyes right there? I mean, you can tell me, but I'm not necessarily going to believe you. Because Hawkeyes and Buckeyes. Man. This is different. Hawkeyes, Hawkeyes are in birds. Buckeyes fall on the forest floor like the dirt they are. But also, Hawkeye banged Black Widow repeatedly. <laughs> um. Also, also, um. If you want to talk, I only, I only, I'm my, the other team I support. I don't support many teams, but I support the ones that my families do. And also, um, the 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 my alma mater, which is the College of Southern Idaho. So it's. So it's uh, the junior junior college basketball championships champions usually nice. a lot. What is the mascot for the University oh, of Southern Idaho? College of Southern Idaho, the Golden Eagles. Well, there you go. I say I I knew a girl in grad school that came from Wisconsin. By the way, I went to grad school in Ohio, but it wasn't OSU. It was Ohio University. So No, no. I don't think OSU has a graduate program. <laughs> uh, no, no. Anyway. I, don't, I, I don't think you understand what I mean. <laughs> anyway. Yes, I do not understand a lot of things that are happening right now. <laughs> Any, anyway. They, they need to have intelligent people to have a graduate Fucking program. Oof. Uh, Venti and, oof. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway, she came from, I believe it was, was it? no, it was Minnesota. It was Minnesota. Oh, no, even worse. Let me think about this for a second. Cause... Hey there, I'm from Minnesota, Ray. Hey, you know, we get drinks out of the bubblers and have bagels. My, bagels, if, sorry. Uh, if if my, uh, oh, that's that's true. My wife does know lots of dumb people with PhDs. Um, <laughs> I have a friend who works IT at a university, and his go-to line is, we're dealing with college professors. By and large, we're not talking about smart people. <laughs> Oof. You're dealing with people. I, I, I would, I would dealing disagree with... with that, except I have had that proved to me on several occasions. Well, you're dealing with Minnesota. You're dealing... It's Minnesota. Okay, so um, she came from... University of was of uh, of Minnesota at Bemidji, like the bird. Like, I'm sorry, is it Bemidji a bird? Oh yes, the small yelling bird with the nose. Sure, let's go with that one. But in any event, they were the Bemidji Beavers. Oh Lord, those poor oh, poor Lord. people. Oh no. 
that's like my poor little Christian school that was uh, <clears throat> the Trojans until um, mm. yeah. yeah, and then True. they became the Warriors, which was just as bad. Okay, I, I don't know good. why the Warriors are just as bad, but fair. There apparently there is also a, the another, similar another brand. Wait, of another brand. Yeah, Wait, Cookie. I have to ask: Were were the uniforms flesh toned? <laughs> no, they were blue and gold. Yeah, All right, were, they were the uh, the the tiny Christian school human beings. So this is getting ready to dovetail. Since we're on mascots, awful pro league mascots. Hey, those of you that are familiar with Cleveland, what's so guardian about a bridge? <laughs> oh no! I have killed the flow. Wait, oh my I goodness. have more questions now. I understand more about bridges than I do of sport. So, yeah. this past year, the Cleveland uh, baseball team, formerly known as the Indians, changed their name to the Guardians because apparently between 2020 and 2022, it became very in vogue to change your borderline offensive team names to the most generic fucking team names you could come up with. See yeah. also the Washington Commanders. No, they, they I, forced, no I, um, they forced, I, uh, uh, ah, uh, Narf. Um, I, I, I like the Washington football team. McMurray. They forced and, McMurray to change, change theirs. Honestly? Hey, uh, how's the car? What do we think of yeah. McMurray? McMurray's a piece of shit. There you go. Thank you. Ah, Oof. interesting. Oof. I'm Oof. just going to point out that we also still have the Seattle Sounders. Perhaps not the best thought-out <laughs> name available. Oh, that's, oh wow. okay. How's the card? That's Wookiee's alma mater there, so there you go. Which one? <clears throat> McMurray. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he, he, he's making a Letterkenny joke. It is a Letterkenny reference. Okay. Um, but, I mean, to be honest with you, if you're going to have a pro team in Washington, D.C., there are so many options you could... You know, the, the Senators the, are already there. They were. The, the, you the, could, that team hasn't existed in a long time. Okay, the, the you current could just, baseball team is the uh, the Caps, right? Yeah, the Capitals. You could bring back the Senators. You could bring back, or you you could say we're the Log Jammers. You they like they back the in the Red like Tails, the and I kind of like that one too. Uh, the pork. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the 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 Washington Razorbacks I think was batted around because of that reason. <laughs> The Washington it, fuck Wait, Oh, no, no, you, no. you know what? You know what? They could change one, one word in that entire name and be perfectly fine. Are you ready? I'm listening. The Washington Red Tape. Yeah. Um, you know what if we just called it football team? Yeah, they, they did, did that. They did that. The Washington football team was a team oh, for a year. Oh, and so the merch? college, so the college that Wookie went to, aka uh, McMurray, won was forced to change its forced to change its name even after nine separate uh, tribes told them they want to keep the name of the tribe. But but uh, they changed it anyway. Okay, this because... is kind of like the Florida State Seminoles, where the team. It, the Florida State Seminoles are actually backed by the Seminole tribe. Yeah. So, like, yep. they're perfectly fine. The Washington. All right. Um, anyway, Grimos wants us to move away from this topic and says regional gothic time. The highway's <laughs> always stopped up. You don't go near it when it's clear. We're still looking for the last kids who thought it'd be interesting to see what comes howling down the highway in the night. And it's not muscle cars. We just tell ourselves they are for our safety. Now, that, perhaps we will have Batman versus the Sasquatch Part 2. I would read that comic. I would happily read that comic. Speaking I do not of, wish to spoil anything, but it features Batman. <clears throat> speaking of comics... <laughs> spoilers, damn it! Speaking of comics... Comics. I did a thing uh, and bought a comic for the first time in years uh, the other day. The Which reason... What? The reason for me purchasing this comic is twofold. One, it is one of the new Star Wars comics to have come out. Okay. Two, it is written 
by the same guy that did uh, Samurai Champloon. Okay. I think it was Samurai Champloon. It's oh, the, yes, the, like the one... head and shoulders, but also they are removed by a sword. <laughs> no, it was the one with uh, Samuel L. Jackson, yeah. one of the lead voice actors. Yeah. And um, <clears throat> Mace Windu is alive again in this comic yep. and looks just like that character. Yep. Yep, that sounds about right. That's, that sounds like a modern Marvel uh, Star Wars comic. And it was pretty fucking cool. The art in it is fantastic. The art is fantastic. The story is okay. It is creatively bankrupt, but we're going to just skate past ah, that bit. Af Afro Samurai, <laughs> thank you, The Law. Thank you. I, I don't know why I was thinking Samurai Champloon, but hey. Uh, every time thought... you said Champloon, I thought you were sneezing for some reason. I... So now what I want is a film in which Nicolas Cage is forced to reenact the plot of Speed, but the entire time he is in character as Ghost Rider and on a penny farthing that will explode <laughs> if he goes below 60 miles an hour. So the whole thing is this. just his legs as a blur as he goes down the highway trying to enforce traffic skull. laws as Nicolas Cage. Because do you know why he would do it? Do you know why Nicolas Cage scary. would do it? Because he's making a movie scary. Sign me up. Yes, because, yes, yes. Because, because fuck you, I'm Nicholas Cage. There was a wonderful, I've got wonderful college humor uh, video Many from years ago. ago that is about Nicholas Cage's agent who, it's spoiler true. alert, ends up hanging himself <laughs> at the end. But it is well worth your time to track down after this. This was, is over. This was before the... Uh, the stereotype where <clears throat> people that just take any movie that comes their way turned into uh, Bruce Willis. Yeah. Uh, let's see. By the way, for the moment, if there's anybody who's here, there it is, Grimo says. Is if you're not already familiar with, uh, and, and you want to be a part of the community, that's the link to the Auxiliary Discord. If auxiliary like be, Discord. If you like to be uh, Auxistic, then there you go. Yep. Do you like dumb things on except, the internet and participating in them? Not. We'd yeah. rather not do that. Oh, not use that? Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. Dig okay. said no, thank you. Okay. All right, fair enough. Yeah. Um, and yes, yeah, streams are on YouTube. BPL76 is what you're watching now. So, 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 why, so, but here we are. So, Para? Yes. Do you want to know what color I made the face on his watch? I'm sorry. On, oh, on this guy's watch? Yeah. Yeah, because I sent you one of these. What color is his watch? Yellow, because yellow is more DACA. This is true. This is very true. Oh, that may, is, does his hat make him run faster? Yeah. Slightly. Okay. Wait, you've uh, I, I, I've I also got a time machine. I've also got some purple face paint uh, on mine uh, and body paint. So um, he's super stealthy and you've never seen him before. This is true. That's true. Hey, did you man? I gotta ask you a quick question. Is the six one nine in reference of being from San Diego, or are you a Rey Mysterio fan? Booyaka, booyaka. Yep, that one. The Spider Man villain has an area code. Yes. <laughs> Understandable. Carry on. <laughs> Always yes, Anne. If you have not learned that about this show yet, you will. <laughs> I have learned as little as possible, but at tremendous speed. I mean, that's also true. <laughs> ox holes. I like ox holes. We'll take ox holes. The other one is being asked to not to be used. Uh, okay. Tio. Sorry. All that right. sounds like a fancy donut product, and I would like to purchase one immediately. Mm. I am not hungry, but I could go for a fancy donut product delivered to my door at no cost to me. It's a, it's a like a, a bag of, of donut oxos. Yes, but fired from a catapult from a moving car going down the street at tremendous velocity, and yet still able to hit the second story window from which I am broadcasting. That would be a Is very, that... very big car because catapult sixty five tons. Also, so... I would need to open the window such that the donut could get inside. What's the temperature in Pacific Northwest right now? Oh, that's an interesting question. Let me find out. Alexa, I was just thinking. What's the temperature? The current weather 
weather is 43 degrees Fahrenheit. With cloud cool, it's 43 degrees, and also there's some weather. Great. That sounds great. Alexa, what's the temperature? Right now, it's 73 degrees. 73 Fahrenheit. in South Texas. Expect a low of 67. 67. He did say it was 43 and cloudy because it's the Pacific Northwest. So he didn't say the cloudy that, seems. She didn't say it's raining. 57. Oh, cloudy. 57 and clear here. Yes, the yes, pistol. That's happening right now. It's uh, it kind of started informally last last uh last weekend weekend, and that's going through until the end of this this weekend, week. I believe. Next week. next week, part of next week. Um, I will be gone to it for this weekend, uh, as will I believe, Para. That's true. And that's where and I then, will be over this weekend. Um, at least. Uh, oh, oh, Cookie, I thought I'd tell you um, my uh, my plans did moderately change because my Friday schedule fucked me a little bit, but I okay. will be there probably tomorrow night, and I plan to stay okay. through Sunday. That's that's good. That lines up perfectly with us. There we go. Hey, guess what? I'm not going to be down there because I live <laughs> too far away. Because Michigan is a long fucking way. Bro, yeah, I was going to say, y'all are jerks. I will not. I will not be on site for similar reasons. Because I'm I'm within like easy driving distance of location redacted, so that's why I'm going. It's a it's a bit of a stretch for us, but it's not too bad. And like it's it's been it's, wanting to do it forever. It's so. a weekend trip for you. Like that's yeah. that's on the outside. Like for for the rest of y'all, it's like. That like you have to plan for that shit. Yeah, it'd be me looking up Amtrak tickets or something. Uh, right. Well, I mean, oh, Amtrak is <laughs> fun though. Uh, here's here's the yeah. thing, Hal. Um, you could do that, but here's what Good. I have discovered about Amtrak through your part of the country. Uh, you're going to Chicago first. Yeah, I know. Chicago. I am is, aware. Chicago, east of the uh, the Rockies, is the uh, Atlanta of trains. Trains Charlotte. contain several volumes worth of Atlanta at any given time this across is, the continental United States. This is true. No one look into that. Provided we abstract Atlanta to the size of three standard hot dogs or below. What about a hot dog mech? I was oh, unable to locate the circle. original hot dog mech, to my great disappointment, but I did find Godzilla eating a hot dog. Oh, I mean, that's also pretty good, but it's not quite the same thing. Damn that's it, I knew great. I should have bought that damn hot dog mech like two years ago. I knew I should have yeah, fucking done yeah. it. Yeah, you should. Very disappointing. All right, my uh, current uh, in progress stuff is up and in the Discord. Okay, then uh, when we get to the end of the show here in about fifteen minutes. I will. Make I know. I, I, I am. I am stuck in the drying phase right now. So that's why I've been uh, going back and forth on these orcs. Yeah. Uh, I have four models that I was going back and forth on, and unfortunately, all of them are. Uh, I kept muting myself briefly because I was doing uh, uh, fan and uh, indoor spray paint. Gotcha. You were doing that thing you're not supposed to do. Gotcha. Uh, I, <laughs> have, I, have, I have a door wall behind me, so it's like blowing straight out that door. Okay. So tell me, how, how well can you see sounds right now? Not real well. Wait, hold up, hold up. You... Uh, I checked out for a minute. I came back to you did that thing you weren't supposed to do. Something about uh, eating something and no. the wall missing behind. Did you eat enough Taco Bell to ass blast the wall <laughs> into oblivion? <laughs> yes, and is there just like a smoking crater of a chair and devastation? <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, yes. listen. We call that one an F five. No, no, we call that one, one a quesarito. Ass edition. No, we call that one a quesarito. No, no, let's be honest. If that's anything, that's no, a Mexi no. melt. <laughs> the, he's, damn, was that the uh, deep fried cheese on the layer of caramelized cheese, which fried in cheese oil? No, no, uh, the, no the, that's the chupa queso. I feel like you made that one up. 
No, I did not. <laughs> that was made up by someone else, but it's a real thing you can make. And it's basically a cheese omelet, but without the omelet part. You just have so it's caramelized just cheese, cheese gotcha. onto which you add more cheese, and then you dust it with cheese after folding over the cheese on the cheese. If you put that on fried bread, I'm pretty sure you can get that uh, made for you in Old Town Albuquerque. Sounds reasonable. Right, Cookie? Alexa, play Albuquerque! Do not do that. I just saw Pistol Reference McRib. Long uh, rib. Co- cookie, uh, right. is that something that you can get on fried uh, bread in Old Town Albuquerque? Probably, but I wouldn't go anywhere near Albuquerque with a 10-foot pole because I like being alive right now. Uh, what happened to Albuquerque in the last 10 years? Roving gangs of feral dogs. That's also probably Ooh, true. Can I pet them? Am I allowed to? Is I that mean, legal? You can, you can, can try. try. Someone get me my robot petting hands. Oh, I need to go pet say, dogs. Well, let's, <laughs> let's just say that uh, that um, uh, the hotel we, we stayed at, like shortly after we stayed there, had a shooting. And so, yeah. Oh we my just... god, the dogs are shooting people? Yes. Yes, yes they are. That's exactly Watch what out! Watch out! That dog has a gun! What? What? No, I don't. It's, it's that Hellboy comic. The monkey has a gun! <laughs> oh Lord, my ears! Guys, you got to remember, life is rough. Oh, oh sweet goodness! <sighs> I'd like to apologize Swish. to the listening audience. Space I'd like to apologize to the listening audience. I apologize for the very little that I have done tonight. You know, strangely, it's not been you tonight, has it? That's a change of pace for us. Yeah, that's also been weird. No, yeah. it's it's mostly been Halzakar. Yeah, yep. yeah. We're gonna blame you for this. I'm pretty great. I mean, that's the word you could it's use. He, yeah, he, you are allowed to say that's just weird. Uh, but yes, also welcome to the party, the Gray Man. The Gray Man. Oh shit! I was looking for him earlier and I didn't see him. That was uh, a well, joke good. specifically for Halzakar. He's gonna like it. Wait, the Gray Man's not anything like the Dry Man, is he? <laughs> dry. <laughs> Humans can exist in a wide variety of states of dampness at any given time. That is why they are upset with laundry. Now, Hal, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, we're not telling the Dry Man story because there's nothing less interesting than listening to someone else's D&D story. I I have sat on a panel where two people on it just kept doing that for ten minutes. Yeah. Until we drug the topic, kicking and screaming away from them. Yeah. Yeah. But, in any event, Great man, glad you could be here. Ah, sniffing paint fumes. <laughs> Welcome to the maddest place, probably on the web right now. Are, are, are you but seeing those sounds yet, Warlock? Nope, nope. Unfortunately, there's not that much uh, left to sniff. Oh, because he sniffed it all. That's kind of where I was going. Um, uh, I, I may have to sniff a bit more because it looks like I missed some stuff on Darth Vader. Oh, darn. Perhaps Darth Vader should wear his underwear on the inside when going to an HR meeting. Dolores doesn't particularly appreciate that. says, please drink the things. Okay. The oh, things. drink? Drink? Oh, God, I haven't done that I in like two hours. I will meat hydration for my human secondhand <laughs> self-regenerating meat skeleton contained on the outside of my calcium skeleton, but beneath the layer of presentable flesh for the world. One moment. My bottle of Aldi ripoff Guinness is empty. Man, I hate you right now. I just, like, I'm so offended by the words that just came out of your mouth. All the Guinness in the world, and this is the one you're out of. Yeah. Oh, shit! Oh, you know what? Man. I can't even follow wait, that. Wait, wait, I'm wait. just going to let it the go. The Satan Master found the hot dog mac. I need a link. Well, gentlemen, it's eight, it's eight, gentlemen it, is eight, it is eight minutes till, so, you know, okay, tying okay. up I, would I, be a I, thing. Okay, okay. Give me a... But, but... Uh, he fra- hot okay. dog, hot okay. dog, hot dog, hot dog! Okay, I posted that link earlier, and the site wasn't loading. I wonder if it was just temporarily down. But my mech, it has a first name. It's O S C A R. It will temporarily download a hot dog. I can't even be fucking mad at you for that one. Damn it! Yeah, you're you're mad that you didn't think of it. I just, I just, my whole world is in an uproar right now. Okay, this is where we got on these orcs. Like, I'm pretty happy with these orcs. Their pants aren't painted, but like. 
mean, let's be they honest. Have gray pants for like for, uh-huh. for speed paint, like that's pretty good. Yep. Yeah, or just hey, hey, I, white I, pants I, legion. I, I do want to go ahead and uh, re- respond to that orc thing. Why didn't you use orc flesh? Um, because, because paint brushes are much cheaper. Because it. Quick. Yeah, that that point goes on the board. Oh, what I do is medicinally <sighs> similar to helping. Okay, so I, here's why I didn't use orc flesh. Orc flesh does not have enough variance in its tone. Okay. Like I have tried it before on orcs, and it's just like it's it doesn't it doesn't work well for me. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so I'm gonna like put some stuff over here so I can actually use <sighs> my computer. A giant fuck all pile of paint. <laughs> that's only going to continue to grow like some kind of hydra. Yes, you know, like, like, like uh, when when you finally tell me to send you scale seventy five. Yes, I will ask you to send me like a, I will exchange money for goods and or services at some point. What does it cost? Or I... What does it cost to buy your intensity set? Intensity? I think it's like thirty five bucks. Oof! How many paints uh, just... are in it? Uh, hold on, let me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Still, let's do math real quick. That's like that's that's a little My more than I pay for Viejo and in shipping. Valley oh, Joe paint. You're just gonna keep this up, aren't you? Ah, oh, yes, yeah. the Vallejo. It's <laughs> not old. Now, it what, is. what I'm what I'm going to tell you is when you bring up my in progress photo, uh, the intensity is what I have used so far on the Red Guard. Okay, so you you have been you the, the intensity is the one that you have wanted me to use for a while. Yes, now. so that's the the, the Red Guard. There is intensity crimson. Okay, give me a second. That that's a very similar effect to the alcohol inks I have actually. Exactly. Only it's an acrylic base rather than the alcohol base. So it doesn't entirely fuck your brush. Exactly. Okay. And and you can thin it down to the consistency of water and it still has great pigment. Okay. That's the thing that Scale 75 has that I absolutely just love. Okay, that's the one that I'm looking for. Uh, red Dudes. That's what we're naming this image. <laughs> red Dudes. Uh, photos. Like You know, Squick is right. I got to do something better with this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. So, okay. There. There they are. Now everyone can see them. I see them. They so that, that is uh, that is base coat black, mm-hmm. um, and two coats of the intensity crimson. From there, I'm probably going to mix that with the, uh, um, the, 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 the not the what color is it? The blood red from the speed paints. Uh-huh. The blood red, uh huh. The not it, the slaughter red. Correct. Uh, but this kind of gives them their uh, look of, you know, their armored robes, kind of shininess and so right. on and so forth. And now I get to go over to give them their full red red. Right. I hit the highlights with a uh, oh. more mundane red. Yep. I was going to ask a question, and maybe we I should wait and ask this another day. What you got? But I had a really, really weird idea. Okay. Because what? I've been looking at, at crafting things that are not paint, you know, that are not, uh, and, um, uh, 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 Tim Holt sells a kind of the, the of an acrylic style thing that works on other things, and I was wondering if anybody's ever painted with the Distress. Distress ink paints um, on minis. I can't say I have, but you could absolutely try it. Because one thing that I will continue to say to my audience is that you can't ruin a mini. So you could always strip it off and uh, go again if you're unhappy with what you get. 
I've never painted with distressed paints, but my painting is distressing. <laughs> but, yeah, but me too, but you know. I don't know. I just thought that was interesting if, if I mean, anybody. It's absolutely worth that trying. Stuff. Like, I've seen people do some pretty good painting with, like, frankly, staggeringly cheap uh, craft paint that you can buy. At, that's what, you know. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. yeah so, I've seen that too. Like the, the apple barrel and the plaid stuff, like, like I'm not on board with that for my painting, but you can do it. Like, there, you can get some results out of that. It's just like, it's it's not going to behave the way you want it to behave when you start trying to do stuff like thin it or dry brush with it necessarily. So, like, yeah, you could probably get something pretty good out of it. Hey, we got Posture a check. check. Oh, 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 no, my human <laughs> spine has been realigned by my applicable meats. Damn it, hell. Get the apple mm -hmm. barrel paint. Okay, Fezbear, I'm going to argue with you hard on the white because the white gets super chalky for me. Oh, I was just prepared to argue on general principle. We have something to argue about? Ah, actually, that that is one of the things that you're going to love if you intensity sets. It's, it's is not they, chalky. It, it can't be chalky if it's almost the sea of water. This is true. Now, and I they had do chunky have water before. They do have white ink, and that shit is <laughs> amazing. All right, folks, um, it is, let's call it 11 o'clock real quick, uh, just so that you all have to go to bed with this image. Here's Flesh Colored Marauder. I'm going to drop this in the mail to Squick because it's his fault. No, it's Meat Rodder. <laughs> meat Rod. Meat oh, er. Christ. <laughs> it's, you no know, the, the thing that I notice about that Meat Rodder? Girthy. Guys, oh, we're that going is very off the air concerning. now because I hate everything that's being said. So I hope you all have a good night, and we'll see you next week. Good <laughs> night, folks. <laughs> Later.